Welcome, this is uh, the H145M. This is the heir of a family which is started, which has started uh, several years ago with the BK117. The first evolution of the BK117 was the EC145. This helicopter is quite new, especially in France, being used by the Gendarmerie and the Sécurité Civile. This helicopter has been uh, approved by all the crews because of its power and its ability to save people, rescuing them in mountains and over the seas. We decided to make the most of our technology and the innovation that we had on other helicopters. So the first innovation was to change the engines. The previous version of this helicopter was already powerful. We have decided to make the most of a new engine and then taking the power with an electric regulation, we are able to have 100% of the power right in the end of the crew. The innovations are ju not just the power, it's also the workload, which means that we have made uh, four axes autopilot previously on the EC225 uh, and these four axes autopilot, first autopilot designed by the company for helicopters is fitting this 3-ton-7 uh, class helicopter. In order to make the synthesis of all sensors and all equipments of the helicopter, we decided also to develop ourselves uh, an avionic called Helionix. These helicopters got power, got an electronic regulation, a full avionic, the workload is fully masterized. It's not only the tools to make the mission. If you've got the power, if you've got equipment, then you can make the mission. But please come and see uh, the cabin of this helicopter. You've got two big doors, you've got clamshell doors, you can transport up to two stretchers with this helicopter adding in the cabin three paramedics. But obviously, with such a cabin, if you add a hoist, then you will be able, thanks to the four axis autopilot, to carry out search and rescue, very demanding search and rescue missions. This helicopter has got a flat floor, which means that you can make a configuration quite easily without tools in few minutes, taking this helicopter from transport up to search and rescue or EMS. There is another innovation we decided to integrate in the previous helicopter with this H145M. You've got the Fenestron. This Fenestron has been invented by the company and is critical for a crew. Because once you've got a bit of speed, 100% of your, your power will go to the rotor. There is something else, safety. When you use this helicopter with the clamshell doors in order to rescue people, when you go to the stretchers, you can see that here the people can be protected as the Fenestron is safe. But of course there is something more. When you are flying, a terrible failure could be the, the loss of your tail rotor. Here, if you've got a bit of speed, you will be safe. You will only have to land with this little speed. So from a civilian perspective, and of course, from a military perspective, the Fenestron is a great achievement for safety. Of course, once you've got the power, once you've got a Fenestron, which is pro providing you with safety, you need equipment. We've seen that all the equipments were already developed on the previous version. But there is something brand new, which is the H4, the generic weapon system, we decided to develop in order to transform this civilian helicopter into a light attack helicopter. For the first time ever, this helicopter is able to fire all kinds of weapons, from ballistic, 12.7 mm up to 20 mm, rockets, two guided, laser guided rockets, missile, air to ground, air to air, and of course, laser guided rockets. 
There is something unique in the world. Before you had to fly an attack helicopter to be able to use those weapons through a thermal camera. Here, once again, we provide the crew with tools in order to masterize their workload. For the first time, the pilot will have to fly when the crew commander becoming a true gunner will have to fight. In a nutshell, this helicopter has got power, has got tools to masterize the workload, you've got equipment and you've got weapons. Hence, we can say that this helicopter is definitely a multi-purpose helicopter. Thank you.